So, it's Saturday. That's right. I'm just filming this on Saturday, guys. It's been a crazy week. I'm so sorry. I know it's promised Fridays. Every single time I came into the studio, there was something going on and I couldn't get recording and it just, it's not been the week I thought it would be. I thought I'd have a little time here and there. I never did. In fact, right now, I literally have only about 10, 15 minutes to film this video and then I got to pack everything up. So to get right to it, first of all, Top 10 games, my picks, of course, coming out this summer. There's been a lot of change ups in the game industry because of COVID-19. There's been games canceled. There's been games postponed. But there are some titles coming out this summer still and some good titles. Um, there's more titles than this, obviously. These are just my top picks. Some are exclusive. Some are non-exclusive. So, And I will make sure I either say that or forget. I'll put it somewhere on the screen. Um, but I want to say something before we uh, get started into the video. So if today I got something special I want to do. So there's top 10 of these games, right? So if in the comments below, if you put in the name of the game that you want to see me play, I will buy that game this summer and I will live stream my gameplay. That is right. I will play the entire game via live stream for you guys to watch me play. So it's just whichever game gets the most comments of its name in the comments below, that game I will be purchasing this summer and playing for you guys. So please comment. Also, I'll take time to do a plug for like, comment, share. Please like. That's the best thing you can do for the channel. But also subscribe, hit the bell, share the channel with your friends, guys. We were doing so good. We hit 30 subscribers pretty quickly, and then it just kind of slowed down a little bit. So we're more than halfway through this thing now. So please like, comment, share with your friends. Let's get the subs going so we can hit that goal of 100 subs by the end of May here. So that being said, oh, also, if you like the content, you can you can uh, join me on Patreon. So I have a subscription as low as $1, high as 20 25 bucks. Uh, you, the description will be in the link below. So, and I mean, uh, huh, the link will be in the description below. Wow. A little tongue tied today, working fast. So some of these games are going to kind of speed through the ones you're going to be able to tell the ones I don't really care that much about and the ones I care more about. So here we go. Diving right into game number one, Odd World Strangers Wrath HD. So a lot of these titles that are going to be on this video are remasters or remakes. This is one of them. This is a different one in the Odd World series. Uh, if you're really into the Odd World series, this will be a great game for you to get this summer. It is coming out on June 9th. June 9th is its release date. So, and it's a Switch only title. So if you've got an Nintendo Switch, you're into the Odd World series, Odd World Stranger's Wrath on the 9th of June. Uh, the wonderful, the wonderful 101, wonderful 101. There's a remaster of the game from the ground up. It looks beautiful. It technically is already out available on Switch and PS4 digitally. But if you're like me and you want physical copies, it's coming out this summer on June 30th. So June 30th, the wonderful one-on-one, -on -one, such a cool game, very unique. Uh, I thought it looked amazing, but it was only on the Wii U when it came out. I've never had a Wii U. So this is a game I may pick up whether you comment or not, just because I've always wanted to play it. Super interesting gameplay. You have the 101, um, um, uh, I guess, superheroes, whatever that you play in. And they, as a group, you know, can uh, form different objects, and you platform through the game, through the action adventure with the uh, with the wonderful one on one. So, looks super cool. I'm excited about it. So, if you're wanting to get that on on physical copy, it's coming out June 30th. Kingdom Majestic, the Kingdom series, is a really interesting series. It's a strategy 2D side scroller. So, wrap your mind around that. Some platforming in there, puzzle solving, but strategy based, but side scrolling. Super unique, gorgeous game. They have mastered the art of 16 bit graphics, uh, as you can see on the screen. So, what this is, it's there are two main titles bundled into one um, in a physical copy. So, these have always been digital only games. You can now get it in a physical copy. This comes out on PS4, Xbox One, and Switch on June 18th. So, June 18th, you can pick up. It comes. Um, once again, with uh, the two main titles of the Kingdom series, and you get it on physical copy. So if you like the Kingdom series or you never played, it looks interesting to you. Uh, if the aesthetics look beautiful and it's something that might interest you, that comes out on, on June 18th. The Ghost of Tsushima. The Ghost of Tsushima. I'm not going to spend a lot of time on this because this has been heavily covered. This is a PS4 exclusive, people. I've been super excited about it. Sony just released fresh gameplay footage of this game. So... 
it looks amazing, beautiful. You can actually put the game in a mode that you go, that's uh, I think called uh, like a samurai mode or something like that, which it plays like an old 1920s uh, samurai movie. So everything is beautiful monochrome. So you get the cinematic feel while you play. The game just looks amazing. If you're a PS4 player, it's an exclusive for PS4 and it's coming out on July 17th. So July 17th, be looking for the Ghost of Tsushima. Uh, if you want to see more on that, just YouTube it. There's tons of videos already out there on the Ghost of Tsushima. Paper Mario, the Origami King. I am super excited about this title. I love the Paper Mario series. They are super fun games. There's been a couple that have not been as great as others, but overall, it's been a really great series. Um, they just announced this, just announced this, I believe, last week, and already it's coming out July 17th. So, way to go, Nintendo, not having anything out about any of your games and then just dropping a bomb on us that a game's coming out in two months. So, I'm super excited about Paper Mario The Origami King coming out on July 17th. If you're into the Cat Quest series of games, Cat Quest and Cat Quest 2, the Possum Pack, are coming to a physical copy. You can get both of them together um, for PS4 and Switch, and they're coming out July 31st. July 31st. If you're into the Cat Quest series of games, they're super fun, super quirky, um, uh, uh, kind of like an RPG action adventure. If you're into that, Cat Quest, Cat Quest 2 coming out. July 31st. Now, this one is technically not this summer. I think it was, and that's how I made my list, but then it got pushed back. So, Dead Cells. I talked about this in my first video. If you have not watched that, what? If you have not watched that yet, a little tongue twisted there, guys. If you've not watched that yet, I'm going to have a shameless plug to, let's see here, this way. If you click the link that should be right here, you can watch uh, my very first video that I did on the, um, uh, I think the top 10 of each of the shop sales, I think something like that was called. Um, once again, the link is up here. Um, if you click that link, you can go there. I talk about dead cells in that video, so I'm not gonna spend a lot of time on it, but it's a physical copy, a limited edition physical copy coming out August 25th, August 25th. When that's being released, um, super sad that it got pushed back, but very excited that that's coming out. I like collector's editions, and you, of course you guys know I like physical copies. So Dead Cells, the Prisoner's Edition is what it's called, coming out August 25th. Um, Xbox and PS PC exclusive, um, Grounded, coming out on 728. This looks like super fun action adventure builder so if you liked honey i shrunk the kids um if you don't know what that movie is then you're obviously a whole lot younger than me if you liked honey i shrunk the kids this is the game for you literally you are people you are these uh, teenagers that got shrunk these kids that got shrunk and you're in your backyard and you have it's a survival game uh, it looks amazing um, there's uh, harvesting and building stuff in it. It just looks gorgeous and fun. It just looks like fun. So if you're looking for a game that's just gonna be fun, very different, and you, once again, a fan of Honey, I Shrunk the Kids, Grounded is the game for you. That is coming out on July 28th. And once again, that's an Xbox and PC exclusive. So Grounded, July 28th. Here is another, this is a PC exclusive, Valorant. Valorant, I am very, very excited about. It is essentially take the the um, battle set like the um, the customization systems of um, Overwatch, but with the specific gun firing of CS:GO. You take those and you mash them together, and you get Valorant. Very excited about this. This is a game that I probably will get, but it's a PC exclusive. So. Just remember that if you're looking it up and you get excited about it by the gameplay that you're seeing right now on screen, this is a PC exclusive. But Valorant comes out summer 2020. They still not set the date. Really hoping it doesn't get pushed back to COVID-19. Hopefully they'll put a release date here soon. But Valorant for PC, a Overwatch CSGO mashup game essentially. It looks amazing, looks beautiful, looks, uh, looks just so a little different. Something new in the first person sh shooter genre. So, and last, but not least, the game I am most excited about. Long coveted as a hidden gem and a cult classic of PS2 retro gaming coming this summer on Xbox One, PS4, and Switch is none other than... Oh! Who lives in a pineapple under the sea? That's right, SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom is coming back rehydrated. What does rehydrated mean, you ask? Just as their funny way of putting remastered. I am super excited about this game. It is a platformer action adventure. It was a classic. 
so much fun. Of course, it's a familiar character that we all love being SpongeBob. It looks absolutely amazing. Uh, if you look up some other YouTube videos or some guys have done side by sides to see what it used to look like and what it does now. Very, very, very excited about this game. This is actually the one that secretly I'm hoping you guys put in the comments the most because I do want to play this game. So SpongeBob SquarePants, the battle for Bikini Bottom. So anyways, guys, that's the top 10 games coming out this summer. Hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you agree with the choices I made and I hope you go out and get some of these games. So just uh, remember, uh, stay safe during this time. Um, excited that I'm sure you all are excited that school is either over for you or coming close to the end. And uh, just have a really great summer. Here's some really great games for you to look forward to. And uh, don't forget to like, comment, share. Please share the channel, share the video with your friends, your family, uh, share it on your social media, let everyone know about the channel. And um, also uh, subscribe, click the bell. Don't forget to do that. And don't forget to ask your friends to do that. Hit subscribe, hit the bell, and hit like on the videos. So anyways, guys, until next time, this is Turner Tech, and I'm glad you watched the video.